Hey friends, welcome back to my channel once again. Richard Moll Buldi Belaf on Night Court dies at 80. Shaving his head for a movie helped him get the part of a lifetime and he spent nine seasons on the hit NBC sitcom. Richard Moll, the fun-loving actor who portrayed the towering and tender-hearted bailiff Aristotle Nostradamus Bull Shannon on all nine seasons of the popular NBC sitcom Night Court during its original run has died. He was 80. Moll died peacefully Thursday at his home in Big Bear Lake, California. His publicist announced suitable for his 6-foot, 8-frame mole plate and abnormable snowman alongside Ringo Starr and Barbara Back in comedy feature Caveman and he was scary, decomposing Vietnam veteran in the horror film house. Moll also did lots of voiceover work with a regular gig as the immortal bodyguard Norman on the syndicated series Mighty Max in turns as Harvey Dent to face for three Batman cartoons. Moll had a shaved head and he did that to play the warrior who worked in the sci-fi film Metal Storm, The Destruction of Jared, when he auditioned for the role of Shannon on Night Court created by Rainhold Week. They said, Richard, the shaved head, looks good. Will you shave your head for the part? He recalled in a 2010 interview. I said, are you kidding? I will shave my legs for the part. I will shave my armpits. I don't care. With Night Court being nominated three times for the Emmy for Outstanding Comedy series, Maul came up with catchphrase OK as he appeared on all but one of the show's 193 episodes from 1984 to 92, along with the likes of Harry and his son, John Larroquette, Charlie Robinson, and Marky Post. Maul was not involved with the Larroquette Top Line Night Court reboot that returned to NBC for 2022 to 2023 season. Charles Richard Moll was born in Pasadena on January 30, 1943. His mother, Violet, was a nurse and his father, Harvey, a lawyer, a history and psychology major at the University of California at Berkeley. He graduated in 1964, then worked as a deputy probation officer in Alameda County and a ladies' hosiery at a store in San Francisco. He came to Los Angeles in 1968 to pursue acting but found the going tough at first. He got to play a cannibal in Hearst commercial opposite Don Adams and then Joseph Smith in 1977 biopic about Brigham Young before landing parts and episodes of Welcome Back, Cotter and the Rock Ford Files. In 1979, Moll was cast as a gangster in the two-part Happy Days episode Fonzie's Funeral and that led to appearances on other two Gary Marshall Created shows Laverne and Shirley and Mark and Mindy. He filled out his resume with work in films including Hard Country and Ralph Bakshi's American Pop and on such TV shows as The Misadventures of Sheriff Lobo, BJ and the Bear, Buck Rogers in 25th Century. Bull was going to be very hardish, he told People Magazine in 2003, but I think this was something in me to make him a lot softer at the Manhattan Municipal Criminal Court, his character sweetly bonded with family bailiffs, Selma Hacker. Moll also played himself in 1987 on a two-part episode of NBC's The Facts of Life and recurred as a drifter on the 1999-2002 Nickelodeon comedy 100 Deaths for Eddie McCowd. He also showed up in Highlander, Baby Lawn, Five Married with Children in Anger Management and in the film Stuff and Stones, but I'm a cheerleader. And... Scary movie too. An avid bird watcher and nature lover, Moll was married and divorced twice. His second wife, Susan, was a daughter of Milton Burl's third and last wife, Lorna Adams. Survivors also include his children, Chloe and Mason, and his stepchildren, Cassandra and Morgan. That's all for now. Subscribe for more.